Okay, I just have to know. Does anyone else get mosquito bites that look like this? This is a mosquito bite I got yesterday. It's just getting worse. And this is normal for me. But I'm curious if it's normal for anyone else. It's like, you can see how big it is compared to my hand. The redness is like in here, but it's the swelling is like this big. And it's hard and it's like yellow and it's hot. It is mosquito bite season, so let's talk Skeeter syndrome. This is common in adults, but even more common in children. You or your kid gets bitten and within a few hours, it's like, boom swollen, red, hot, itchy, and you're wondering, is this infected? Skeeter syndrome is a local allergic reaction to a mosquito saliva. It's not an infection, it's basically your immune system saying, how dare you, and going full overreact mode. Hey, I'm Dr. Mona, pediatrician mom, and I share useful development, health, and parenting tips, so hit follow if you're not already. So why do some people get it and others don't? It's just how their immune system is wired. Some people have hypersensitivity to mosquito saliva. It's more common in young kids and those with self-defined sensitive skin, but many outgrow it over time or their extreme reaction can fade. It usually shows up fast. We're talking within hours. You'll see big swelling, redness, and it can feel warm or firm under the skin like the woman had in this video. It's often itchy and yes, it can look pretty dramatic, but here's the key. Even though it looks intense, it should start to fade over a few days and usually within a week. Now cellulitis, that's a bacterial skin infection. It doesn't come on fast, like right away with Skeeter syndrome. It tends to develop slowly, maybe one or two days later, and it might be painful, tender, and can sometimes come with fever. It usually spreads gradually and isn't always as itchy as a normal reaction. So how do we treat these local reactions, even if they're large, like in Skeeter syndrome? cold compresses, anti-itch creams like hydrocortisone or calamine, and my personal favorite tool, the bug bite thing, it's a little suction device that helps remove irritants from the saliva before the immune system has a meltdown. It works best if used right after the bite, and I can't stress how much this little thing has helped me with bug bites. And of course, if itching is very severe, we may recommend an oral antihistamine like cetirizine, or in rare cases, an oral steroid to help with the inflammation. And again, call your doctor if you're not sure if it's just an allergic reaction like Skeeter syndrome or something more. If the redness is rapidly spreading, warm, painful, or your child has a fever, we want to rule out cellulitis like here. So yes, your mosquito bite or your child's mosquito bite may look like it needs its own zip code, but with the right treatment, it's usually nothing to panic about. Follow for more myth-busting, relatable pediatric content from a doctor who's lived it and treats it.